Thank you very much. Slavs, Gujaras. Oh, I milled my or housed my mill. Big sad. What this issues did every four have? How much time do we have? Baby Viper on stream one. Not for a long time. Mm. Slavs Gujaras. I do want to play this. I think I'm going to open archers. Because why not? Like a minute? Okay, uh, ignore it. I cannot explain it to you. Sorry. I for this had a lot of missing features. It was a very lackluster launch. If they could develop the game for another year before launching, launching it would have been a lot more successful in my opinion i mean it was still successful although i mean i cannot say that for sure but my perception is that it was still overall successful but yeah oh yeah let's go skirms spear skirm we have good food economy let's do it so yeah it was still successful but i think they lost so many players the first couple of weeks a couple of a couple of months because they were missing so many features and they took so long to fix problems like severe problems in the game but i mean i think i think they still sold enough copies and dlc copies for it to be considered a success for them it just could have been a lot more I'm unable to click the deer. Okay, I got it. What about Cyberpunk's game? It's bugness that turned out fixable in two years. Yeah, I, I never played Cyberpunk, but I knew know there was a lot of drama around it. I never played it myself, though. So I cannot say how bad it was. Wipe, you look a bit like Kobe Mainu. <laughs> I have to say, that's that's a comparison I never expected. That's that's an out there comparison. <laughs> Cyberpunk was decent, but you probably probably couldn't have played on the stream. Explicit content, I see. There's something very appealing about AV2's art style that I miss in AV4. So I could never get into it. Yeah, I mean, it's a thing like Stormgate as well. From what I can see, a lot of people are complaining about the art style. Not necessarily art style, but just the quality of the graphics in Stormgate at the moment. They might have a similar issue there right now where it's, it's just turning people off. Yeah, this, I mean, that's the thing, right? Games have deadlines, and a lot of games are being pushed out too fast. They would have had been so much better if they got a little bit more time to finish developing the game. With that said, Stormgate is in Early Access, right? But God, how I have it, hate Early Access. Early Access as a concept. I hate it. Just develop the game and finish it. I mean, I understand that devs might sometimes need funding to continue developing. But back in my day, when I bought a game, it was finished, you know? I went to the store, I bought a uh, CD cover with the game, and the game was finished. And I could play the game. Now you buy a game and it's being developed while you're playing it, so you don't get like a proper experience from the start. It's just... I really just don't like that. 
cannot put sheep in mill anymore? Well, with Gojaras you can. I'm not Gojaras. That could have been ugly. I could have trapped units in the woodline if I built the barracks initially. Or load balancing for online content, but features should be more complete. Yeah. I mean, it goes without saying, right? Back in your days, developing was way cheaper. That's probably fair as well. And we look at Baldur's Gate as well, right? How long was that game in early access and developed, being developed by it during early access as well? So there's, there are massive success stories as well with this in mind. But yeah, I just don't, I don't like it. The amount of times I've bought a game and tried it while it's in early access, just to be like, this seems like it could be fun, but it just doesn't feel complete, so I just stopped playing it. That's... I just wish more games were finished. <laughs> early access is free quality control. It's not free, it's paid quality control. They get paid for, for us quality testing their game. I mean, don't hate the player, hate the game. I understand why they do it. I think he expected me to go scouts. Uh. <laughs> It's making a range already. That's already a victory for me. He wanted to open scouts. I've been able to force him into a range already. I need to see where his town center is. How far away is it? Can I run past? Wait, it's, oh, it's there. Okay, this is fine. Oh, poor skirm. Poor skirm. <laughs> they think I'm getting a very good trade so far here. Bam! Nice. We're through! But skirm suck! I actually don't want to be here. It's too risky. Villagers are too strong. And I, he's doing my strategy of losing villagers so he can... So he can have a bigger army. He has learned. Get him! Nice. It just feels like he's in a bit of trouble, doesn't it? Another one. What? Come on. Damn it. Okay. I want to take his mill so I can get his sheep. That is my game plan here. Let's do a blacksmith so I can get upgrades as well. Stolen strat, yep. He's stealing my strat. The thing is with slavs as well. Slavs, however you want to call it. You just have a good economy in this situation. Because you have some healthy farm setup. Oh, Mill is going down! From Spears and Skirms. Gotta love that. Mm, I mean, I guess I can still fight this. 
I have the upgrades required. He doesn't have enough cavalry units for this to be scary. And I have, I have Botkin, not Botkin, fetching. No, you will not repair the mill, sir. Your sheep are mine. I'm gonna do armor as well. Actually, no, let's do forging. Uh, he really wants to keep that alive, doesn't he? <laughs> no. I'm housed though. I missed the times when I was on. Come on, I just need the sheep to pop. I have put all my skirms on different control groups ready to snipe the sheep. Damn it. It didn't work. Fine, I'll just run on, kill you somewhere else. Um. I need to run with these. They don't have a pike support. He's doing a market. What units are we playing Castilla Age though? I guess I'd add a stable here. Noise. Still can't afford blacksmith upgrades by the looks of it. God, this guy. <laughs> brave guy, brave guy. Is he even on gold? He did a market, so maybe he's gonna buy his way up. He's just moving to gold now. So he might have a very big Castilla age timing advantage. Uh, we need two stables. He can obviously make camels. Which could be tough. I can make a lot of fast monks. Night Pike Rush? That is a, actually an, a good option, potentially. Oh, I had units here. Yeah, I'll just open some knights and we'll adapt. We can probably transition into whatever we want. He has some skirms, but they don't have good upgrades. The scouts don't really have good upgrades either. What? Why is he going back? Bro, this is your timing to do something. Fine, I don't make units then. As you wish. Why would he go back? When is Red Bull date? Early October. He can't make camels on the way up, so... Yeah, he's doing it. How do I do against a camel with knights? I wonder. The issue for me, oh, if you can call an issue, he has scouts alive still, so he can potentially snipe my monks. We do want the town centers as well, but eco upgrade wise, we're doing fine.
Starting town centers. Oh, that's good. I want to snipe those. Give me knights. See, I need two TCs right away. Give me those. Noise. Yeah, I'm, I'm super happy with this. Super happy. Killing all those scouts. Do I go for it? Are boys realistic? You pikes don't be greedy? I don't need pikes. I have monks. Don't need pikes when you have monks. Again, I mean, I'm down in score. But I feel like I'm in an amazing spot. Just passing. Need more farms though? We're slavs, but yeah, I am adding farms now. Just need to set up TCs and wood economy first. like this. Probably gonna commit here. Oh, he actually went back. Yeah, we got him. Okay, then I wanna commit here. We're gonna fight for this relic. He's aware of that relic. I'm aware of it. We're probably gonna fight for it. Took my relic. That is unacceptable. I think that's never going to be a good trade for him. See if I get that relic. He also still has some skirms sitting around that are not really useful for him. And since he went for the three TCs right away, he has a smaller army. <gasps> he took my relic up there! I probably can't fight that. Heavy on stone. Fourth town center. I guess I'll sell it for three relics. He's doing a, that's a very defensive castle. Rude to take the last relic, I know. Kids these days ain't got no respect for us elders. What's my army choice here? Help, Boyar? I don't know. 
I'm probably too aggressive there. I don't think I have enough units to fight him here. I think he has a better army than me. I don't think I'm looking to fight. How's Voyager? Let's do it. I don't know if I can fight him here. I can heal, right? So maybe this is still fine. Not sure if that was fine. That was probably not fine. Let's get the monks and I'm happy. Okay, we're, that was fine. You are so fucked. You think so? I feel fine. I think I'm in a great spot. Am I just delusional? I swear I did pikemen earlier. Mm. This castle is a little bit sus. Is he doing his own castle? Yeah. Uh, he cancelled it. And now he's building it on the hill. Oh, we'll just build it here. He has some skirms alive. What? And now he's backing off again? Make up your mind! Wait, how did I get four relics? I thought I only had three. That's awesome. Get them. Low HP knights. That's annoying. <laughs> oh well. Wheels are strong. I need to get the detonates so my castles are cheaper. Wasn't it someone who just literally said like a minute ago that I'm dead? That I'm fucked? I heard it. Is it a normal ladder match? Yes. 600. What? How fast did my thing go down? From freaking whatever those are called. Why is that nice taking so long? What? They have four damage. Do they ignore armor or what? <laughs> Melee attack? Yeah, but still when they have like those, they don't usually have that much power, I feel like. Uh, I need that. Okay, that nice is finished. Just spread castles a bit for production. Oh, he's doing his own castle there. That's fine, we'll prepare a bigger army. I need a second blacksmith. Um, it's nice. We can take that stone. I have too many vills, I think. I think it's also important that I get the market. 
I'm going Siege Ram held, Boyar. I see you there. Gonna be peaceful for a little bit. We'll see what he's cooking in terms of unit choices. I have too many bills. Full chakram. My boy should be sick against them, no? Oh, why am I doing this? <laughs> it's guilt to make Trebus better. Yeah, I want to sling him some resources, help help him out a little bit, you know. While we do this, we can go here and build a castle. Goddamn castles costing wood. I can't afford it. Steals population in skirms. Okay, let's see, shotgun throwers. <laughs> I laugh in your face. Shotgun throwers. What is this? This unit sucks. What a shit unit. Come on, the rams keep moving. What a horrible unit. Honestly, I didn't expect them to be this much stronger. <laughs> but that was actually complete. I mean, it's, it, it makes sense, right? They have 11 melee armor. They have 6 attack. It's only 1 at one damage. Of course, they have pass-through damage, but still. What's the cost of a castle now? 260 wood, 390 stone. I guess that's still a pretty good, pretty damn good upgrade. How's new house and kid? New kid? Both very good. You got like 60 disco throws, then they're good. Against Boyer? I'm not sure. Because even then, you only do 60 damage per hit. Of course, you can do it to like three, four, five units at the same time, but you still need like three volleys to kill one Boyer. Does it cost wood and less stone to repair the castle once you get the tech? Yeah, it costs wood as well then. The ratio is like changed. We're miles ahead in the economy, holy cow. So my feeling was correct. Like village account might be somewhat similar, but I think resources are collected, I'm probably quite far ahead. 150 disco towers and they're good, yep. Cool unit always wins, true. Warriors are pretty sick. 18 attack, 11 melee armor, 7 pierce armor, 150 HP. The only problem is their cost. Wait! True, they lowered the cost. It used to be 60, 80. Now it's less gold than a knight. So this is a crazy good unit if you have the castles to produce. 